I was on website, banggood.com, saw this device. I'm going to open up the plastic here. Uh, it makes a lot of noise, so I'll open it up off camera. Um, what this is, is a USB to OBDC2 adapter. So this ODBC2 port is underneath the dash of your vehicle, and that's where the mechanics plug in their, all their testers and they can tell you what's going on with the vehicle. They can read all the codes out of it. And uh, I saw this on, their, on the uh, banggood.com site for, I think it was $3 or $4. And where it's Bluetooth, there's actually software programs for Android devices, maybe for uh, iOS devices as well, iP iPods and iPads, those type of things. Um, but I know there's Android ones. And I'm going to do a review of that um, once I get this hooked up in my, in my vehicle. Anyway, let's open this thing up. So what you get, it's an Elm 327 Mini interface, supports all OB, OBD2 protocols. So there's a certain model year of car, um, 2000, I want to say it's before 2000, but uh, anyway, all the newer vehicles, this will support. You see under here, it's the ODBC to connector, all those pins, and this port is underneath the dash of your vehicle, usually under the steering wheel in that area. Being Bluetooth, you'll be able to pick up the signals from, like I said, I'm gonna, I have an Android phone, and I also have an Android uh, tablet. So I'm gonna download the applications. One free one, a demo program is called Torque. And once I get this plugged in, get the app downloaded and tested, I'm going to do a video on, on how it works. Um, so this comes with your adapter, comes with some software drivers. I, I'm always worried about drivers that come on discs like this. Um, is there a virus on it? I don't know. I'll never end up using this. So, all I was interested in was this device here. Something to look for. Um, again, it's an ODBC2 Bluetooth reader. So if you wanted to go in and see what that error light is on your on your vehicle, why what's what's going on? Why is it flashing with the check engine light? You plug this thing in, download an application onto your Android device, or if you had a, a MacBook, I know that I think some MacBook Pros have Bluetooth should be able to read it as well um, and with the proper application you'll be able to tell what's going on inside your car so that's a quick unboxing of this I will go through like I said do another video of this product in use and I'll put a link to it so if you have any questions please let me know Zoom in a little bit so you can see the model. And thanks for watching.